Welcome to Sigma Tech Tricks. Today we are going to fix a broken key from a laptop. It's a pretty old laptop as you can see behind me. Uh, one key is broken and customer do not want to buy the new keyboard. So let's fix this uh, key. I already have many scrap uh, keys, keyboards. From that we will pull it one key and we will fix it. This method you can do it at your home also if your one of the keys uh, broken or it, it if it comes out of the keyboard so let's do it I'll show you how to do it so this is the laptop all the keys are working except the key except the K key the K key also is working but as you can see uh, the rubber and the clamp is not there so we will pull it up from another keyboard and we will try to fix this keyboard let's remove the keyboard and then we will search for another keyboard and then we will take it out we will place it so guys we have removed the keyboard and here we have two similar keyboards this one is not working keyboard and this one is working keyboard so we will pull out this K key from this keyboard and we will put it here so most of the time you, you see uh, there is only this clamp clamp will be missing or the upper part will be missing okay or it might be broken so if the rubber is missing you have to place the rubber also below this key there will be a rubber which touches the main board main base then only the keyboard will function so let's pull it out slowly Slowly you have to pull it up, make sure the clamps do, do not break. And now we have pulled it, you can see the notches are intact and the rubber also is there and this part we need to replace on the other keyboard. So we will pull it out first. Now we have pulled it and then we will keep aside and we will remove this rubber as well. So for to remove this we need a sharp, sharp item any knife or something like that and then we will remove it. So guys we have removed the rubber as you can see this rubber has to be there to make it functional okay now we will put this rubber and the clamp as well on the other keyboard so now we will put this clamp as well as this and the rubber so let's see how we are going to put it. First we will place the rubber. To do that we need a fevicuic. So we will put fevicuic here. One drop.
as you can see guys with the help of fevquick we have placed this rubber here and now we'll put the clamp oh. here we can see two sides there are two small notches you have to make sure these notches are inside okay this side and this side and now we'll put it back make sure we are you are putting the right side and the other side correctly okay now slowly push it Okay guys you can see the notch has been attached okay now we'll put it the top part the button now just make sure this one and this both has to be placed properly this one this side and this upper side on the up top side so we'll put the key from the top and we have to slightly press it now you can see guys this attach perfectly now we will put this keyboard into the laptop okay guys you can see now the keyboard has been fixed and the key k is k button is working fine okay so this is Okay guys so this is how you can fix your keyboard at your home if suppose entire keyboard or few keys are not working in that case you need to change the keyboard itself on this video only this much to watch more videos like that please subscribe my channel and like the video if this was informative thanks for watching have a nice day